Hello Taurus and welcome to your Twin Flame reading for December. So whether this is your sign or you're cross-watching for your twin sign, you're going to receive messages and the angels want me to remind you how important it is to be playful during December, to really enjoy the month ahead because it's filled with magic and possibilities, not just because of Christmas. You know, not all of us celebrate Christmas. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. But the magic of the in, you know the incoming new year you know the new year ahead because the water rabbit that comes in at the end of january is really saying to us everything you've been wanting in 2022 whether it's a career goal a manifestation something connected with your twin it's all going to start showing up for you in 2023 this is where the magic is taking place and how you feel now during this month of December, will affect your 2023. So if you're focused on blessings and magic and gratitude and the good in things, you're going to have so much more to be grateful for as you start the new year. If you're struggling or in negativity or focused on fear, you're going to bring that in. So remember, watch your thoughts. Your thoughts have power. You are a creator. You are magical and you are strong. And remember, any time you start going up into your mind, just ground yourself through breathwork, meditation, going in nature and feeling at peace. So I'm going to bring in the spirit of the animal oracle today. So I'm going to use a gorgeous spread for you today. So we're going to use the six card spread that George uses in his reading. So we're going to do a card for you and a card for your twin for the energy of December, the lessons you're learning and the action steps being taken. So let's see what you need to know. So what's the energy around you during this month? So whether you're the Taurus or, you know, you're cross-watching, this is the energy for you. The energy around, they're giving me lights as well. There's a van across the road and it's got flashing lights. So there's going to be lights. I feel you're going to see magical lights in December. I mean, I know we have Christmas tree lights and lights on when we go shopping, but I feel lights are going to be a symbol of magic and change, magic, magical change, you know, seeing fairy lights or lights in magical ways. What's the energy around your twin in December? Thank you, angels. What lessons are you learning and what lessons are they learning? What lessons are they learning during December? There we go. Let me just move these up a little bit. And what's the action step that you're taking or what guidance are you being asked to be aware of in December? And the energy around your twin. There we go. Okay. So the energy around you in December, we've got the squirrel always prepared. Wow. Now, squirrels may be a big part of your journey. So you may see squirrels during this time and flashing lights. They give me flashing lights across the road. Okay, let me turn it around so you can see. Can you see that? It's an open reach. Oh, it's reversing as just as I did this. An open reach van. So be open to your twin reaching out because that's what I'm feeling. And yeah, it's going now. So flashing lights are about magic and power and open reach reaching out. Okay, so this is obviously a big sign coming through through the intuition and signs that we see that things are changing and that your masculine is preparing to be open and reach out and there's communication coming in. It may not come in December, but it is on its way. And the squirrel is the gatherer. So it's like the squirrel is coming to you and I feel you may have a real bond with squirrels, like you may see them or they may come to you and saying, always be prepared. The squirrel is always prepared. You know, It's always gathering things it needs. It's always thinking about the future. So you're being prepared for something new. So this always prepared. And I feel this is a message to be prepared for anything because anything can happen in December. This is going to be a magical, powerful month for you. It says you are the expert of hard work and hard play. So you work very hard, but you're also starting to play hard too, to have more fun, to make things more equal. So, you know, if you have a busy month at work, you're going to do something for you. You may book a trip or you may do something for you. Your cheerful and fun disposition is a blessing to everyone. So, you know, you've got so much to give. Your light and your love has power. 
So, you know, you are a blessing to people in your life. So, you know, you've, you've got this cheerful disposition. So even though you struggle, we all do, you keep your thoughts high. You keep your, you know, your vibration high a lot of the time. So you operate in this power and that has power to others. So, you know, you help and guide others just by being you, whether this is family, you know, people you are connecting with in service, you are giving and loving and people at work, you know, you've got this cheerful disposition. It says, don't let life's distractions take you off course. So our ego can be a distraction. Fearful thoughts can be a distraction. Other things can be a distraction. And, you know, you are on the right path right now. And the angels are saying that to you. So don't let anybody or anything knock you off your path or distract you from what you truly want. Make a plan for the future and life will give you all you need. So, you know, this may be a time where you are thinking about what you want to do in 2023. Or when, you know, things are starting to fall into place for you because you're starting to think about what you want. Just like the squirrel gathers those nuts, you're gathering information and knowledge and power. So this is going to be a very powerful, intense month for you because you're working out what you want and where you want to be in 2023. So you have a vision and a goal. So you may be even updating, you can be updating your vision boards or your creation box, but you're planning now for what's ahead. So the energy of your twin during December, we've got the dog and the dog is about loyalty. So We've got friends. So I feel that your twin wants to be your friends, wants to regain the friendship. And this is what's on their mind in December. So they may be trying to come back into your life as a friend. That doesn't mean that's all they want. It means right now that may be all they're capable of giving to you. But he's missing you. I feel in December your masculine is missing just being a friend, you know, connecting with you, going out for a drink with you talking to you, you know, connecting with you in a loyal way because your masculine is showing you with the dog that they are loyal to you and they want to work on the friendship. The friendship is the glue that holds the connection together. You know, me and George, you've got such a solid union because it's built on this friendship power. You know, we're best friends as well as lovers and that's what you and your twin have and will share. So your twin is saying, I want to be your friend. So I feel they could very well come back into your life in December, but you have to be open to anything, you know, open to the way they reach out. If they want to be your friend, don't take it personally and that's all they want. It's his way of showing you he cares and he's missing you. It says, today, I will love without condition. So I feel this is a big message about unconditional love, loving each other without conditions, without demands, without needing it to be a certain way thinking, oh, we have to be together now, or it has to be this way. My energy and enthusiasm are an inspiration. I choose to be happy. I am a protector and a friend. So your masculine is saying to you, your twin is saying to you, you know, whether they are the Taurus or you are, I am a protector. I am your friend. I'm trying to do the right thing. So remember, if they aren't around you in December, they're trying to protect you because they care about you. They care about you as a friend as well as a lover. My energy and enthusiasm are an inspiration. So I feel he's getting more energy during December and feeling more enthusiastic about your love and your connection. So the real message here is, you know, your twin is loyal to you and does want to be with you and spend time with you and wants to be in your energy, you know, as a friend because they miss you. So it's very likely that they could be around you as a friend you know, or a protector, you feel them around you, you feel their presence around you in December, because you're getting ready for the new year, so the energy around you then, the lesson you're learning, we've got two cards for you, the lesson you are learning in December is to love, isn't this beautiful, we've got the deer, so the stag may be shown to you very powerfully during December as a symbol of the divine masculine's return, but also as the love that you share. The deer is, you know, I've got the deer here, the stag and the deer. You have to look close to see the deer there. But the deer is a symbol of love and gentleness. It says, be gentle with yourself. So be very gentle with yourself in December, whatever you're doing. Be gentle with you, be kind to yourself. It says, you heal with the power of love. 
see the light in all things, acknowledge your self-worth and grace. So that's what you're being guided to do. That's what you're learning in December, to see the light in all things, to be in the energy of love no matter what, and to acknowledge who you are, that you are worthy of love, great things, that you are powerful, and to be very gentle with yourself, to take your time, to know that you don't need to rush anything. So, you know, if you're missing your twin, if you're feeling a bit vulnerable, be very gentle with yourself, kind to yourself, giving and loving to you. So self-love is the key to your 2023. And wow, we've got the B for community. Now, the B is a symbol of a miracle. So there's a miracle coming to you and you're learning that this love that you share with your twin is a miracle. It's a miracle in itself to be here on this earth plane, but it's a miracle to be a twin flame. And you're realising that more and more every day through the community you have. You may be building your own community. You may be connecting with soul family here and you feel safe. So you realise you don't need to be surrounded with people to feel safe because your angels are with you. It says you are a powerful creator. So this is a huge message because your twin flame is sending you a bee during December to say our time will come. There is a miracle on the way. They are realising that they are powerful and they have the, the power to be a creator in their life. It says your work blesses everything you touch and you are realising that you are blessed. So I feel you are one. You feel merged towards one because even though this is your card for your lesson, I feel this is also what your twin is learning too. And bees are coming to you from them and from heaven as a symbol of power. So you may not see a physical bee, but you may see a bee on a, on a mug or a t-shirt or something else. Your work blesses everything you touch. So your work, the work you're doing right now, service, this is your lesson. You are blessing others. You are helping others. You are being you. It says be open to receiving sweetness. You are the queen of abundance. So during December, you're going to feel very abundant. You are the queen of abundance. That means you are a manifester, a creator. You attract in what you want. And there's miracles flowing into your life. And the more you focus on gratitude, the more they increase. The more you realize that you can have, be and do whatever you desire, the more that that comes into your life and you feel confident and strong. So there's a lot of power here. So the D is about love, unconditional love, being given and loving to the self and others. And the B is a symbol of that bringing in a miracle. So your lesson is to trust the love, to be in the energy of peace and allow things to flow to you. So the lesson for your twin, we've got the dragonfly, wow. You may be connecting with an Aries, okay? Because I am picking up an Aries energy when I'm connecting with you too. Or you may be on the cusp of Aries in your own sign. But whatever sign they are or you are, there's changes here. So your twin is saying, I'm starting to transform. I am embracing my transformation. I courageously let go of the past. The magic of nature is in me. I am brilliant and I am blessed. And the dragonfly is about change. So in December, there's a great change occurring magically within your twin. They're going through a transformation and they're starting to courageously with power, let go of the past, to be more in the now, to connect with nature to realise that the power has been within them all along. So this is a great message that in December, your masculine is transforming into who they're meant to be. So the action that you're taking in December, we've got the penguin, wow. This is so powerful, this is coming up because penguins are about breakthroughs. And I feel the penguin is a symbol moving forward of December to be authentic. So the action step for you to take is to be you says reach out to your tribe in times of need family gives you the strength when you face the storm so in other words your tribe your soul family here on guided by angels the people you're connecting with will help you get through this month love your uniqueness you are full of surprises there may be storms around as well you know like actual storms i've just banged my foot as well so you know be careful of the minor things in other words, don't stress over the minor things. So take your time. Don't rush around. You might bang your toe up or hurt yourself. Just, you know, calm your energy. Do things slowly. Because you do tend to rush around like a whirlwind. 
you know, you are the bull. So the bull is connected with, you know, force. So do things at an easier pace, especially if you are connecting with an Aries because Aries are the ram and they ram around too. So just go slow. There's no need to rush anything this month. Take your time. I know it's going to be a busy month, but take your time. Love your uniqueness because you are full of surprises. So there's magic within you. Surprises coming to you, blessings, presents, great things. Break free from others' expectations and just be yourself. So the action step for you to take is to just be you. To just be yourself. You shine your light and do you and the magic will flow in. So you being yourself and authentic will magically attract everything in. So in other words, you don't really have to try so hard or do anything during December. It's all going to flow in. Just work on raising your vibration. Be very loving and kind to yourself and the universe will take care of the rest. And the action step your twin is taking during December, personal choice, wow. So your twin is saying, I'm making a choice that's very personal to me. I'm choosing myself. I'm choosing to do things for me. It says, close your eyes. What animal do you imagine? What strength are they known for? What wisdom do they share? Embrace these qualities. So your masculine Jew in December is starting to tune in with their instincts, their animal instincts. And they may be really resonating with a certain animal right now because I feel they have a spirit animal or a spirit presence around them. It could be the dragonfly, okay? It could be the dog or even the wolf. I'm feeling a wolf with this too. So, you know, they may be spending more time with an animal if they have their own dog, but they are really tapping in with the dog spirit and the wolf spirit and the dragonfly spirit to bring in change and power. What strengths are they known for? Well, the dog is known for loyalty. The wolf is known for intuition and the dragonfly is known for change. So that's the wisdom that's been shared with your twin during this month. And they want to embrace the qualities of loyalty so they can be more of a friend to you, so they can give to you, so they can be with you, so they can make changes to be with you, to release what needs to go, to embrace the power of the wolf so they can trust their own intuition and make personal choices. So this is very powerful because the breakthrough that's coming in in December for your twin is that they are choosing themselves over any anyone or anything else. And that's good because when they choose themselves, they automatically choose you because you are one. So you don't have anything to worry about in December because your journey is on track. And they have guides through animals and angels and loved ones around them guiding them. And your breakthrough is by being you and remembering that you are always supported, that you are the squirrel, that you are the gatherer, that you're gathering everything you need right now. Be open to anything because they could reach out to you at any time. And if they come forward as a friend, be grateful and blessed because that's a blessing that shows they want to work on the loyalty and the support and the foundation of the connection to build it into something more. So being a best friend with your twin doesn't mean that's all they want. It means that's what they want to work on to create that powerful foundation for your union in the future. I hope this helps. Have a great month and I'll see you soon.